Hello from Metang, Thailand. I'm Steve and this is my wife Rebecca and we serve with uh, Nazarene Missions here. We are so glad that Phil invited us to share some of our thoughts on this special day for David and Naoma. Oh, David and Naomi, congratulations. You guys have survived, what, like nine or ten years in the Philippines and then nine years at least in Seafield also? That's amazing. So congratulations. We're so proud of you. Um, you guys have taught us so much. You taught us all about how to live cross-culturally. Mm -hmm. You've shown us incredible flexibility and patience. You ate whatever was put before you. You slept in some crazy places, at least one or two, I'm thinking. And I hope your grandkids always enjoy your amazing stories of following hard after God. One of our earliest uh, memories with David Naoma came before, even before we were on the field, um, probably about seven years back now. Uh, we were, Rebecca and I were trying to figure out how to enter into Nazarene missions, and we felt a call to Thailand. And we had heard that David and Naoma were down in Ohio, so we drove down and we spent the day with them. It started off with breakfast, went on into lunch, and pretty soon we were eating to dinner together. It was a great Indian meal and there was lots of laughter. And I don't know what we expected out of the day, but it was far more than we had ever anticipated. By the end of the day, you invited us to join you on the field here and that has made all the difference in our lives. So we really say thank you for giving us that opportunity. We've enjoyed playing Settlers of Catan with you, and we're going to miss doing that in the future. Um, Naomi, your calm spirit and incredible listening ears are deeply missed. And David, your sense of excellence and your passion for humor and your big laughter <laughs> um, is, is definitely missed. You guys don't give up on people easily, and that really means a lot. And your graciousness and your patience um, have been an incredible uh, example to us of how to live, how to live, and and what God is like. Thank you. I think one of the times that I will miss the most are those. Uh drives from the airport in Chiang Mai back up to Metang. It always gave us a, at least an hour to talk and just share life together. And those times were so meaningful to me. Just to talk about whatever came up. Sometimes we talked about work, missions, theology. But those times gave me a chance to really see your heart and your passion for holiness. Though that, that passion for missions and that passion for holiness really taught me, it really showed me an example of what it meant to be a Nazarene. And I am really thankful for that strong example that you gave us. We thank God for your friendship and we hope that despite your retirement from missions that that will continue for many years. And we just ask that God would bless you in this next phase of your adventure of life. We're so happy for you. Congratulations. Congratulations.